Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Jessica Yik, the Dancing Avon Lady, and today we have a new first impressions video. So more than likely, I will probably have already just launched and um, sent out my uh, video on our new Glimmer Shadow eyeshadows. So that's why you're going to see all these beautiful swatches here. Oh my gosh, they're amazing. If you want to learn more about it, click up here because they're that fantastic. But today we are working on the new Avon collaboration with the Face Shop, our new flat two-tone lipstick. Okay, so I have two shades here to show you, uh, and but they do come in six different shades. So with the way the beauty industry is trending now and the beauty trends that are happening, it seems like even though we are wearing yeah. masks, we are... Um, still looking at those like bright red lips the bold lips and also uh, like gloss is making a comeback to me and that's a little bit surprising because i thought that would be more of a matte finish simply because matte tends to uh transfer a little bit less but hey satin glossy finishes that are coming back and that's all great because you know i love those type of finishes you're gonna see jennifer poking her head here every now and then Hi. It's lunchtime for online school, so we're doing this during lunchtime. So this is through work from home mom life, filming videos during lunch break. And Nathaniel's over there, he's also having lunch. Well, you know, he's having his dessert, so you're gonna hear squawks. Let's get to it, shall we? So this is launched in Camping 21, which at the time of filming is currently right now. And about maybe seven, eight months ago, I did show you the swatch and review on the flat velvet lipstick. I had done the Cassis Red and the Rose Pink. Love those. I still reach for those quite often. And now that we have a two-tone one, I am super stoked. So this is part of our new lipstick launch. And so these come in six different vivid shades, ranging from orange to purple and beige to browns um, and pinky colors. So it's really exciting. I have Pink Delight. And I have purple with beige. I love this lip look, the whole ombre lips. And there's a couple ways that you can play with this one. Uh, and so I am going to test them out for you today. They, it is a slim two-tone lipstick uh, to create a natural gradient ombre look with a single swipe. But if you try to change it different ways, you can get different looks out of it. If it's anything like the flat velvet one, it's going to have a rectangular applicator, um, like rectangular tip, which is actually really fun to use. And this is supposed to, instead of having the matte finish the velvet matte finish that this one has these new ones here is supposed to have a shiny gloss finish and as similar to the other ones it is also a paraben free product so so let's get it onto it and start opening these up so i'm going to do the lighter one first and then as always i do the darker one afterwards on my lips right now i literally um the blooming pink video one that i had on pr previously probably already came off because i did have lunch so i just have some strawberry lip balm on. so here we go let's open this up Woo! Oh, 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 very nice. This is the top of the product, the lid of the product. So you can see the two, I guess, maybe it's to, to show the two different tones. This one is Pink Delight, which is one of the lighter ones. It has a light pink and I guess would be a darker pink. This actually has the expiration date right on it because I never know when lips products are supposed to expire and things like that. I probably have some lip products in my uh, makeup drawer that's like way too old. <laughs> Uh, ooh, oh yeah 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 so it does the match the top look at that beautiful shades wow look at that very nice okay so i'm gonna swatch these at the back of my hands once again guys this is the pink delight this product is made in korea look at that ooh the way that they do it it looks like they are wearing the lighter shade on the uh closer to the inside of the lip to kind of create that pouty look so i'm going to start off with that Naked lip. It has a bit of a floral scent to it. Mm. Okay, so this is just pure on, right? Like just simple applicate, ap applying it as is. I'm going to blend it a little bit. What I love about the applicator is it's very precise. Mmm, wow, it's a lot brighter than I thought it would be. Wow. What do you think? Pretty. She says it's pretty. And the ombre works so much better than I thought. I like the finish. It feels very, very silky. Yeah, it has like a, I almost want to say like a rose. Is that either I'm smelling her ketchup? <laughs> it has a little bit of like a rosy scent to it. <laughs> but it's beautiful. Look at that. Yeah. 
<laughs> Alright, gotta finish this up because school's starting. Sure. But it's a beautiful finish. I like I like the shine to it. It's a nice subtle shine. So you can wear this a couple of ways. So you can wear it like this, or you can just create a nice simple blend by putting it on hor um putting it on which way? I guess it'll be like more like this way. I'll just show you on my bottom lip. Right, so it kind of gives it a, a different look. It's not as ombre, but it's just more of like a a less intense bright or a more intense light. But overall, it's nice. I like it. Ignore the the poor nail job. It goes on quite thick, like not thick as in like there, I feel like there's like a huge layer of it on, but it does glide on. It does glide on really well. When all else fails, use micellar water to remove stuff. Next off, what we're going to do is we're going to try out. This one here, which is the purple with beige. It looks really nice. Look at this. Ooh, it is a lot darker than what I thought it would be, but that's okay. Even the beige though, even the beige has like purpley shade to it. Let's give this one a quick swatch. Oh my god, look at that color. That's so beautiful. Yeah, it smells the exact same. It's like that rosy rosy scent to it. You know what it reminds me? It reminds me of the first time when I was a kid walking into a Crab and Evelyn store. Yeah, crab Treat. Crab Treat and Evelyn store. Alright. That rose water hand cream. Yeah. Alright, so Naked Lips. Look at that. Oh, wow. Oh my god, I'm in love with this one. <laughs> my daughter says when I first put it on, it looks like I have a mustache. <laughs> All right, why is that, Moy? The other one's going bump, bump, like, like your mustache. Ah. Oh. At the first top. Ah. Oh. Like you had a mustache. This one is gorgeous. Look at that shine. Whoa, I love it. Okay, I'm gonna blend it now. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, I love it. Wow, this one is redonkulously gorgeous. Okay, I am totally sold. This might be my new go-to hey. medium one. I love how intense this color is, and I love the finish. It glided on really easily. It, sm it feels like molten, like melty chocolate on my lips. Hey. Mm, I love this look. Do you like the color? It matches with your shirt. She says it matches with my shirt. Oh, wow. This one's beautiful. I love this one. I'm going to wear this one the rest of the day. Wow. This one's stunning. And aligned like along my cubist bow really easily where my daughter thinks I looks like a mustache. <laughs> um, but it's just such a very subtle look. It's like liner and everything all in one. Wow. I love it. I love it. Okay. Totally love this one. All right. If you're a purple fan, purple with beige, guys. Total fan of this one. This one's stunningly gorgeous. The pink delight was really pretty. It was very summery, very, and it would be a really nice spring color. But this one is great. This is, you know, I probably even just wear this in the summer, to be honest. I don't really pair my lipsticks too much this season. It just depends more on my mood, right? It really does. Hi, message from Future Me. So it's about three ish hours later. And here is how the lipstick has been lasting. I mean, it's still super duper pigmented. Feels fantastic. I haven't had any touch-ups, not even for lip balm or anything. Um, I've been drinking coffee, kissed my husband, kissed my kids. It is trans it's not transfer free, so you do need to know that. But it does leave a beautiful like stain to the lips. So that um, throughout the day, if you wanted just to add on a balm, it's definitely doable. So I'm like super happy with this product. All right, guys, so that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this. So, yes, this does come in six different shades. And to see all those six shades, make sure you do click on my Easter link down below in the description box. And while you're there, check out that Join Avon button and see whether or not becoming a beauty ambassador would be right for you. If you're new to this channel, do me a huge favor. Hit that subscribe button as well as that little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. If you enjoy review videos, make sure you do let me know by giving me a big fat thumbs up on this channel. Um, and let me know in the comments below. Do you love the ombre look or do you like a simple you know one tone lip or you know like what's your favorite type of finish i love you guys i'll see you guys in the next one bye